Hello everyone, good morning. A great start to the week. Good morning, Anil. So market uh, looks bullish to start with. It has taken support exactly at uh, level of 25.20. We'll wait for a bit before initiating a trade. Just let the day start. <coughs> in stocks, I'm looking at Adani ports for intraday. The reason is I'm interested only if it moves down. Very clear, right? So although it made a bullish candle here, it is not able to sustain that bullish momentum because of the overhead resistance. Now it could as well decide to break this and go up, but then I'm not interested in that trade i'm interested when it breaks 1414 uh and i will do 1400 p right so that's my plan nifty as expected it's uh taken resistance here so this is what i was wondering let it figure out for itself first where it wants to go and then we will if needed initiate a trade the swing stocks i have shared in the members only section too early to say that well let's <coughs> Godfrey Philip is doing very well. The stock we discussed on Friday. So yeah, so as of now, it's going to be range bought between 2500 and 2500 as a bigger scale. So instead of breaking down, this guy is, looks like it's going to give an outside breakout till 1426 to 1432 it can go. I'm not taking that rate. I think we missed the entry in this. So what can happen is if we can go till here and if so, then we will buy into that bullish pullback for our upside target. There's only one target about this, I think. 25, So this would be a good trade for us to take so we have reached our first target resistance now uh, we should get a pullback from somewhere over here i don't know from where it will come probably from 25 maybe and this is the pullback that we will so what's the exact level take a fibonacci the low and wherever it goes say it goes 25 and let it come back and we'll... yeah, it's going on its own way okay we'll not chase we'll patiently wait so look looks like we have a intermediary thing from which and to launch ourselves 25 to retracement level and the target remains it 25 and so what we're going to do is we're going to switch down to a five minute time frame see whether this support area makes sense yeah so either it's going to take support at 25093 or at 25060 and 65 sorry so since it's a very powerful up move it could reverse from 25082 also so what i'm going to do is i'm going to add based on shorter time frame candles i might even try to enter at 25082 level to try the next 25100 call option a favorite aeroflex is going to make a new high I believe beautiful no 203 is the I hit made last week and once it crosses I think it will go to my, my target is 232 on this so as we wanted nifty is retracing let it go down no not even a hint of it so without retracing we cannot obviously enter the trade as well the reason why we are not jumping is we want very good risk reward ratio we're not gonna risk more than 10 12 points on nifty options right now we have a state where the call option are just increasing in price just like that <laughs> price has price is moved anywhere still waiting still waiting for a nice pullback the 25082 level minimum 25082 is nothing but the 38.2 retracement level so Adani, it's opened high and it's moving higher so i still don't have any shorting opportunity so we need this whatever uptrend that's going on to break the trade so that's just because i'm bearish it doesn't mean that the stock has to come down so we will follow the stock but i'm not going to trade long for in it it could go up or i wall you know but since i'm bearish on it i'm looking for for example uh an ema break right it's slightly hugging the 10 ma so we'll wait for this trend or whatever it is it's just got going on to break and give a bearish candle only then i'll just Meanwhile, Nifty continues to be playing games. Yes, the 10MA is so far away, so a pullback is a must. This is our golden area of support. You can see the 10MA is also slowly going there. Good things to come to those who wait. Or it may not come today, but it will come definitely. Some, some people might want to trade this breakout again. For me, this is too far away because anytime it can pull back, it's a risky trade. I don't want to do any kind of it. So I have uh, mapped the next leg of Nifty movement. Uh, it will be available for members by the by end of day today or tomorrow. We can get an amazing trade okay so this is breaking out here 25 155 look at sale and exploration make a good move in a messy area it is zoomed watch out for geo lighting so we have to now recalibrate our level so it's now 25 089 to 25 075 where we look for the way it's going without any kind of retracement there might be a problem it doesn't retrace this move probably we should stop so adani ports i'm going to enter short below 40 20 stop losses stays high at 1426 going to do it through 18 uh, 1400 put option 
<laughs> so I put in a bid for 18.55, get it? Okay, foot filled on one, moving up 18.6 for the rest. Okay, so I got filled on all. No, I just wait. So this is pretty. Yeah, okay. So target wise, I'm looking at 14.04. Okay, so now Nifty, suddenly we can see it has created a couple of shooting stars. So if you had jumped in somewhere here, and didn't book <laughs> big problem. This is the problem of getting in uh, late and when getting in when markets is not giving the opportunity. So we must really, really wait for our support levels to come. And not only that, we should see a positive candlesticks also over there right so like how i waited for badani ports still at the same price but the contract itself is moving down matter of time so the market will give you signals right We've got two bearish signals now on the five minute chart and if you look at the 15 minute chart that's also in on its way to create a bear candle so if it goes to 14.05 then get around five to six pieces off right so we're looking for 18.6 so around 23 24 25 is what we so nifty came to our support level let's see if it reverses from here well i like some more consolidation over here you can really see that this is good bullish up move okay we are into serious money in adani ports now if it goes to 1420 i'll add it to add to the position mm -hmm. adani ports put option is 20 19.75 you see the target will be also the gap right so 20 21 all these are resistances but wow it's already up to about rupees guys amazing so he said you know, we'll always get some opportunity either in nifty or in stocks and i will never ever chase anybody in my life so nifty kya baat it come now it needs to prove itself still now it's uh we are on a five minute chart so these candles are not really significant we really want significance we have to go to the 15 minute chart in which we see a shooting star and the two the huge length of 50 bucks so again this is an untradable candle so it's more looking like it is going to reverse the trend and come back all the way to 25 20 and below where did i say i was bullish i'm not can you just rewind and see i said i will not take a bullish trade I said um you can say you can rewind the stream and check i said below 1414 14 was my initial entry planned but the market instead went upward from there so i waited for the trend line hey come on here the trend line i drew and i said i was waiting for breaking of this trend line so okay so nifty is now giving an interesting short opportunity if i'm bullish on adani ports why will i talk about put yeah is there something wrong please don't get confused guys it's very my analysis is always very crisp and clear if i had put both put and call option yes your doubt made sense but where where have i talked about being bullish at all i said if, if wherever the stock goes up i'm not interested i'm only interested in downside anyways if you miss the trade that's okay we'll get another one Zealand is not giving record as expected a key is also not giving so we're moving these 23 right so we need this candle to close uh, red a lot of time still to go for this candle close then we have a nice stop loss right around here just 20 rupees loss index so we are in major money in Adani ports even for a single lot well single lots not much major money as long as you are not trading ulta as long as there is no loss of money it's fine everything is okay so it looks like it's validating our level 25089 so whiskey traders can go long about 25105 25 100 call Adani and meanwhile has reached near day low expectedly some support can come in here so this is the candle which will decide which is doing now now 10 133.9 boom 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 to 25155 we should get Adani ports be careful now top loss should be 19 point uh keep it at 19 so you don't have any loss because so Adani tends to resonate with nifty so if nifty suits up like we expect it to then we'll have problem so 25164 is our target and we have got one three stop loss is the current low that is 122 11 point stop loss because once this breakout has happened it should not come back that means it will go sideways for two more hours this needs to go like a bullet Take bar a high cross over here 120 i think it will fire this is as i telling you from the morning there is no point chasing anything it will retrace it will retrace it will retrace at some point of time and that pullback to that extension is what we are always looking to trade now the only danger is now this guy is very very far from his 10 moving average on 15 minutes so if this candle Candle needs to close well. Two minutes. Mm, no, this is the candle I didn't want. Let's keep our tight stop loss and that's it. We can't do anything now that we enter the trade. A good point is uh, Dani Ports is now 21, 20.9. Good option. That point if he is not going active. See, it still remains bullish. Dani Ports, new day low. Let's see if we're going to crash now to 3 as they close of 14.08. 21 21.7. 21 so I am now close, make, making 15k on this. Like the one lot, we like will be 
like thousand six hundred, I guess. How much you make is not important. It's all about your percentage return on your capital. R O T E return on capital employed. Now do we have a don't ever you can time make it hide by moving to nineteen point two or so new. So nifty consolidating like this is good for longs because if it was going to be negative then we will see this candle breaking the low of this and then fall in one shot as long as it goes sideways we are in good hands but the moment it starts getting dirty candle then that's when it's all so right now and again near our buy price sorry okay friends so it's time to wind up the stream for today so we have two positions right now one is adani ports put option which we are trailing at 19.2 and we have nifty which is uh, slightly looking dodgy so we are keeping a stop of uh, 122 or below and we are looking for nifty for a target of 180 158 180 any, any in that range and for padani ports we are looking at around 20 24 so i wish you good luck with the rest of the day trade well trade safe thank you for joining really appreciate that